We're speaking now to Ilva Bedemors from the Netherlands. Ilva, can you explain to us a little bit about uh, the presentation you made this morning? Uh, I gave a presentation about coastal and tidal flooding. And, uh, well, I do calculate uh, flooding scenarios for the province of Zealand in the Netherlands. And that will be like flooding patterns, a maximum uh, water depth and maximum current velocities. Do you think that the uh, the knowledge and the experience you have had in the Netherlands could be successfully used in, in other countries? Uh, I do think uh, the knowledge we have in the Netherlands uh, can be used in other countries because uh, there are a lot of uh, estuarine uh, areas uh, in the whole world. Um, and the the directives, the the Water Framework Directive and the Floods Directive, how are you? Uh, how are you succeeding in implementing them in the Netherlands? Uh, well, I try to bring in the flooding scenarios and then other people can try to analyze them and use them uh, maybe uh, to make decisions about land use or, uh, well, uh, do we need a factory over there or can we better build our house up in the hills? And are they, in, in your work, are they useful tools? Are they? Um, do they help you in, in, in doing your work and in, in moving it in the right direction? Uh, I do think so because uh, uh, important part is the awareness uh, for the citizens, uh, the companies and also the governors. And do the governors uh, know what to do and do the citizens know uh, how to react and um, well, it's all stimulating them to be aware. Um, what other themes came up at, at uh, this year's conference that you think are, are important? Uh, well, that you have to be uh, very sure what you are looking at because uh, I spoke about coastal and tidal floods but you have a lot of types uh, flooding like uh, pluvial uh, flooding or uh, river flooding. Um, it's all different types of flooding and you need all different types of hydraulic conditions to simulate. So do you think that this type of uh, forum, this type of interactive conference is useful when you're, when you're learning about other countries and learning about new technologies and new techniques? Uh, yes, of course. Uh, I think uh, I learned myself about the uh, pluvial flooding uh, that um, actually I always calculate with a big massive storm uh, what can happen uh, one in 4,000 years and never take into account that it will be raining a lot. <laughs> Ilva, thank you very much. Thank you too.